November 2015, paper 2, question 15. When we expand a bracket, we multiply it out. So we were doing 5y times 2y squared, and then 5y multiplied by minus 3. 5 times 2 is 10, and then y times y squared. We've got 1y outside and 2 inside the bracket. And when you multiply indices, you add the powers. So 1 add 2 makes 3. So there's 10y cubed. 5y times minus 3, a plus times a minus makes a minus, 5 3s are 15, and you've got the single y outside the bracket. When you simplify here, you multiply the ordinary numbers as you would with times tables. So 4 times 5 is 20, but as I said in the previous example, when you multiply the indices, you add the power. So 3 add 2 makes 5, so the answer is h to the 5. With this, with integers, okay, you want to know what values of n satisfy the inequality 6 is less than 2n, which is less than 13. What I need to do is find 1n. So what to find 1n, I need to divide both sides by 2. So I'm dividing both sides by 2, and that leaves me 6 divided by 2 is 3, and 13 divided by 2 is 6.5, or 6.5. So that means n is bigger than 3, so an integer is a whole number, so it's bigger than 3, so it doesn't include 3, because it's not equal to it. So the first value of n, it satisfies is 4, it also satisfies 5, and it also satisfies 6. It doesn't satisfy 7, because n is less than 6.5.